Hey babe, how's it going? Babe, I'm fine. I don't want to do anything really. I could just watch football with the guys over the weekend and we'll drink. Babe, it's your 25th birthday and we cannot do something small. Can we not? You know my mom can just stop by and check up on us and see what's going on. <sighs> right, see you yourself. Perfect. You didn't use the protection. You know it's not the same now. I wouldn't be able to stay up for too long. Besides, I'm clean. You have nothing to worry about. Anderson, that is not an excuse. I should be worried, not you. What's that supposed to mean? Your money is on the dresser. Um, I have to go. Now? Yes, now. But I will see you again. When? Um, I'll just fry this sound. I can totally clear up my schedule. Oh, I have school on Friday, but I also have to assist my friend out today. So I better head out as well. Call me okay? No, I will. Where is my wallet? But I'm sure there's a lot of food for everyone. Yeah. Uh, uh, see this one, see this one. Not the size of our And we're just getting started. Ah, uh, uh, really? So, yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Uh, you want something, Jordan? Uh, yeah. Okay, yeah. so you should have... Uh, Pizza. Yes, two for you. Because you're the assistant baby boy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so... Uh -huh. You don't want to share with me? Because it's not my second <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you. Uh, hi, Anderson. Um, nice to meet you. I've heard so many nice things. <laughs> so, um, Negi is going to be staying here for a while. You know I could need some help with studies, masters, and also it could get really lonely mm. when you go to work and hang out with the boys. That's true. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, and we would have our guest time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Babe, isn't there? You know you were already choking the last time. <laughs> I'll be with the guys. <laughs> ah! Oh, hey. oh, hey. ah, ah. Hi. Come on, I did chop. Negi, you're still cleaning. Oh, Luna, are you sure this is okay? What? I mean, like, you know, me staying here. It's just Anderson and I. It's not a problem. Yeah, Anderson. Anderson is not a problem. He goes to work very early, comes back very late, and sleeps on time. So trust me, one issue. 
By the way, this is a very beautiful house. Oh, thank you. How is he able to afford such a huge space, if you don't mind me asking? So, you know, late parents, inheritance, only child. That is very sad. I know, but guess what? It works very hard and it does everything well, so we're good. What does he do again? He's an investment banker and he handles some of that. He has a share in that estate. Oh. Wow. That's huge. And when we get married, you know, things will change. <laughs> marriage? Yes. My family are so big on marriage. I've known that since I was 18, so that's no problem. What about you? You never talk about a boyfriend? No. Yeah. <laughs> We are just 23. We still have a lot of time. Loads of it. <laughs> Maybe the first step is finding a man. I am in no hurry. <laughs> Me, girl. I'm tired. I want to clean up my makeup. I need to get out of this dress. Let's go. Thanks for the party. You're welcome. Good night. Good night, Good night Anderson. Good night. I like the way she, this guy is acting here. Mm -hmm. The movie. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing here? Hi, Anderson. I was just going to get water. I don't care about that. What are you doing here? Muna said I could stay here. Does she know what you do for a living? No. I only do that to pay my tuition. <laughs> exactly, buddy. It's not like you would say. Listen, I, I, I want you to tell her tomorrow. You, you have to just find an excuse on why you can't stay here anymore. And I want you to cut every means of friendship with her. Do you understand? You don't tell me what to do. You're looking for trouble. How, how can you even know Muna? How? I met her during like the start of our masters and she was literally the first person I became friends with. I don't care. You will stop being friends with her from tomorrow. Come up with some stupid excuse that oh you have to travel somewhere and stop being friends with her. Do you understand me? No. But, but... You're still here. Well, I thought about what you said and I have a little condition. Listen, I didn't say it was up for a bargain. Leave my house. No. What do you mean? Listen, see, I don't know what you've heard, but this house belongs to me oh. and that scene. I know. And I want you to rent me an apartment and give me one million naira. And I'll leave Muna alone. You're sick. I know about Muna's father. What do you know about Muna's father? Oh well, for starters, I know that he's worth over $10 million. And if he's to share that amongst his three kids, Muna inclusive, oh, you don't want to miss that. And um, I don't think he'll be happy to hear that you, Anderson, is cheating on daddy's little girl. You are sick. How does this sound? Bilonia's daughter's boyfriend rapes girlfriend's friend. <laughs> How does this sound? Local hooker serving jail time for defamation of character because you will need to prove those jargons coming out of your mouth. Oh, DNA. DNA, baby. Remember Mr. Anderson didn't use protection. You are a fool. Get out of this place, my friend. Uh, waiting for my money. Have a nice drive.
do I have to be here today? So we have a little situation. What situation is that? Nengi. Who is Nengi? Muna's friend Nengi. I mean, the lady I saw at the house yesterday. Yep. What about her? Who? Oh, wait. Oh no. No. We had sex. What? Tell me you're playing. How do you have sex with someone with your baby in the same house? No, you dummy. Nikki was the baby I was talking to about in the car yesterday. Oh boy. Of all the babes in UAR, you decided to settle with your babe's friend. You deserve an award. Bravo, Anderson. Oh, listen, of course, I didn't know she was Mona's friend. See, so that one introduced us, and I saw it. She was looking so fine. Mm. And then we, we had sex, and we were there now yesterday only for us to go home, and Mona is introducing her as a friend. <laughs> this is bad. You know, this is bad, right? Oh, you think really I don't bad. know that? No, I don't know that. How about you both never talk about it and let it slide? Asha, she is blackmailing me. What? Blackmail? She wants me to get her a house and, and, and one million naira cash or she goes to Muna and her father. At least she has a prize. Dude, what are you talking about? I'm not gonna give her that kind of money. Well, we don't want Muna and her dad finding out, do you? No, 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 no. See, I have endured for way too long to let one, one random girl ruin things for me. So, what do you want to do? I said that's why you are here! Okay, calm down. Um, how about you pay her up and tell her you can't get out of the apartment? No, no, no. See, here's the thing. I know girls like that. Once they get a taste of it, they never go away. So, let me know. What other options do you have? Um... This might sound crazy, right? Mm -hmm. But hear me out, just hear me out. Um, so I'm thinking. Mm. Tiger and his boys actually make things go away for us. Yeah. And, uh, and <laughs> Do you really want to go that route? Tiger and his people are ruthless. <laughs> Come on. Do you? Um, here's the thing. If that girl says, oh, she can go low, I, Anderson, I can go lower and I'll make her let disappear. It go, let it go, Anderson. No. Go. no. No, 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 no. But that's what we're going to do. I shy, no girls like this. That's what we're going to do. Well, I've given you my honest opinion. And I've given you my own, so take it. <laughs> my friend! You know what you have to do? This is so complicated. I can't seem to figure it out. I think you're reading to cram instead of actually understanding. Easy for you to say because your head is full like a book library. You know what? Why don't we just pause for a minute and just we can come back to this. Oh my god, I'm all tired. So, what should hmm. we talk about? Let's see. So, your family. You know, how is it like, like, how's your family comfortable with you leaving with a man at this <laughs> young age? Okay, so don't get it twisted. So, my parents and Addison's parents were very close before his parents died. Oh, oh. And like, we, they already knew we were in love because we used to go swimming as kids and everything. So it was no shocker that I would end up dating in uni. Okay, <laughs> come in. Hey! Hey, Bernard! Yeah. Hi! Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, Bernard, I'm in Negi. Hi! Hi, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Manat talks about you all the time, and yes. you really look very pretty in person. Thank you. <sighs> so tired. Um, is there anything you know? Work as usual. All right, adults. Oh. So, <laughs> I'm Nengi. Whose daughter are you? Bernard. What? Let the girls spill some tea over here. I mean, you know we love to network over here. Just, uh, uh, I, my father is a pilot in France. Oh, I, I mean, powerful. <laughs> I like it. Bernard likes it. Would you mind saying something in French? I, mean, I could like. Uh, Jolie sack. 
<laughs> what does that mean? Oh. Uh, nice bag. Oh. I never knew you could speak French. <laughs> Come on, it's not a big deal. Mm. <laughs> anyway, I'm the son of George Coca, Bernard, Bernard Coca. Same George Coca? Yeah, <laughs> the one and only. I mean, <laughs> no. always. Um, my love, can I get a glass of wine, please? Sure, no. red or white. Surprise me, girl. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'll help with that. It's yeah, fine. it's just a glass of wine. But oh, that's fine. <laughs> Do your thing. Sleep here, girls. Let's go. Thank you. Who is that guy? Why is he like that? <laughs> it's just really silly. He's into the beauty industry, so he takes his looks very seriously. I'm not talking about his makeup. I really don't care about that. I mean, he's quite an ass. Underneath all that, if you really get to know him, he's actually a very sweet person. Trust me. <laughs> sweet. <laughs> The meaning of that changed recently in the dictionary. Oh, really? Want a glass as well? I don't know how long it's here, but I just <laughs> might need a bottle. That's so extra, babe. Take. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Let's get it. Hey, bro. I'm finally here. Uh-uh. I'll fuck. Mm. What do you know? Duh. Would you put that away? This is an office. Okay, I know you tell me that one now. Uh, Andy, I, I tried. Um, no, 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 no. Listen, do you want this deal or not? <laughs> Asha, I don't hear this guy. They only flew Tiger talk like that, too. Tiger, Tiger, calm down now. Don't be sitting in the open eyes for you. So you get clients for you enter. What do you think Karim will come here? Um, that girl he showed you. The picture he showed you. I want you to scare her to death. <laughs> that tiny girl. What did she do now? Um, she's trying to extort him. Uh, yeah. I know I know. You're wearing a ton of key. Hundred and I'll pay in full once I know she's in your camp. Hundred key. Tiger, Tiger, just calm down. Hundred key fear, you do okay. You know, I don't help your boy come up for sale before. Uh, you want me down or come now? No, I'm not scared. I'm not scared. <laughs> Are you serious? I don't like me. I don't like that shit. Oh, okay. So, when next am I seeing you? Girl, you know, when next you decide to come to the country club? No, that place stresses me out. Girl, prices the early to have to pay. You know that. And this girl, I do not really trust her. Why? But well, you guys are just laughing all through the conversation. So? Not with those fake earrings or what? It looks so fake. Hey, you. What? I mean, did you see that? I'll text you. I'll, t I'll just text you. you uh oh. I spilled wine on your couch. Wow. But they're not like Balmain or Balenciaga, so. Um, Who are you, please? So you cut this like even like very little. Okay. So I shape. Baby. Hey babe, I'm trying to call you all day. Oh yeah, my phone was upstairs. Today's Thursday. Why aren't you dressed? So Negi suggested that we stay in tonight because he's teaching me a new recipe: penny pasta with vodka. Yep. So um, and I'm sure you're going to love it. So let me go mm. get my phone. I'll be right back. Negi, okay. come. How's work? What are you still doing here? Uh, I think see a lot. Don't test me. Oh what? Shh. Have you lost your mind? Oh, you will never lose my mind if I don't get my money. Listen, if you mention this to Muna, you will regret it for the rest of your short-lived life. I'm shut up. What are you guys talking about? <laughs> Nothing serious. <laughs> Just a book called A Girl Must Get Her Money. Babe, I didn't know you read novels. <laughs> 
Um, I should shower. I've had a long day working with idiots. <laughs> So should I give this one? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hi, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, Anderson is not at home at the moment. Um, not yet to see you, Anderson. Oh. Mona, um, she rushed out. You can wait for her or just call her. I'm actually here to see you, though. Is everything okay? Oh, please, come in. Um, can I get you water, juice or something? Sit, I need to stop drinking. Everything okay? What's between you and Anderson? <laughs> did he say I did something wrong? Cut the crap, you understand what I'm saying? I have no idea what you're talking about. You do. You do understand. So, if you don't, maybe this will help. I need you to take this check of 250k. Leave Anderson and Mona alone. I see he spoke to you already, but he missed out the part where I said I wanted a million naira. Young lady, come on. I'm not Henderson. Yeah, actually. You know, you're more handsome, bigger, sexier. You know what? I want you to take this money and terminate everything you have with Anderson and Mona. Why are you letting Anderson make you an errand boy? Or has he promised you something? Nengi, I'm doing you a favor here for you. I want one million naira and an apartment. Uh, I'll be in my room. You can wait for Anderson if you please. Oh, and if you need anything, please do not call me. Nengi, things could really get ugly. One million naira. This food as in I'm trying to save her. Nengi! Nengi! Babe, I was surprised you called out to eat out for lunch during work hours. It's just been a lot of work lately, to be honest. Really? Or to impress my dad? <laughs> you know how he loves results. Yeah, but like, why are we here though? Like, why are we really here? So, um, our latest situation is back. Back? Back how? I thought she was gone for good. I thought so too. Anderson, I thought you took care of this. I, I did. I mean, I, I'll take care of it. Don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. Um, we can... Just even ignore her if she goes away. No, that's too much risk. We can't do that. Don't, don't worry, I'll take care of it. This is weird. What's that? It's a text from Nengi saying, What do you think of men in relationships still sleeping with Ukaz? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm fine. Okay. I should go to the office now. Now? Yeah, a lot of work. So, um, you got this, yeah? Yes, yes, I will. I'll sort that. And Anderson, sort what you must. Um, see you later now. Charles, you don't miss me. Did 
since you see my number on your phone, it's me now, Pengi Nengi. As I was saying, ah, me, I miss you and I'd like to see you again. Charles, I didn't get you fired. It was a mistake. Okay, okay, okay. How about I make it up to you? Hello? Hello? Bastard. Hi, Shagun. Shagun, see, I, I was, I was wondering if I could borrow. So, hello, hello. Shagun, I can't hear you. Shagun, the network is... I can't hear you. The network is not bad. Hello? Oh, pick up now. Asha, why haven't you called Tiger and his men yet? I'm handling it. No, 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 see, you cannot undo this girl. This girl is crazy. Trust me now. No, 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 no. So, here's the thing. We've done it your way. Now we're going to do it my way. You're going to call Tiger and his men and you're going to call them now. Because you can't believe this desperate girl texted Mona while we were on a date that oh, what does she think of men that are in a relationship, sleeping with hookahs or something like that. Dude, I'm telling you, she is so calculated. You have to call Tiger. Call Tiger and do it now. This place is going to put me in trouble. Hello. What's up? Where will I get this money? Mommy isn't feeling too good at all. And, and now the doctors want us to make a deposit. I'm working on it. Mommy must know I, I borrowed their savings. Believe me, I'll pay it soon. How soon? It's important. This week? Nengi, tomorrow. And where are you, by the way? I'm, I'm working on something. I'll talk to you later, okay? <sighs> Should I take this to 50k? <sighs> hey, babes. Hey. How was lunch? It was great. I was just so annoyed on how stupid that traffic was. <laughs> Lagos, crazy traffic. I know, right? Anyways, I need a hot bath. Do you get my text? Yeah, but I did not understand it. Did Anderson see it? Yes, we are both puzzled on how random that was. Why? <laughs> Nothing. That's so embarrassing. I was looking for topics for my friend's vlog, oh. so I mistakenly sent it to you instead of her. Yes, I totally knew that was a mistake. Yeah. But wait, anyways, I saw Asha's car opposite in traffic. Was he here? Oh, yeah. He was here. He waited a few oh. minutes. He wanted to see Anderson. Is he not supposed to know that Anderson is supposed to be at work? Or did he come here to see you? <laughs> oh, please. Stop acting crazy. How is that crazy? What if it's true? Is it not cute? Muna. What? Answer the question. <laughs> She's okay. Just not my type. Huh. So what's your type, Miss No Action? Were you not going to take a bath? Yes, that was true. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'll be back in 40 minutes to talk about you and Asha. Oh, <laughs> there's nothing to talk about. <laughs> Anyways, I'll be heading out in a few minutes. Uh, just family stuff, no, nothing okay. serious. Okay, babes.
I'll give it to you. Where's mommy? Uh, I'm supposed to have made transfer by now. What do I keep telling the doctors? To give you a little more time. No, I learned that was the weekend that transfers don't work. I have to go to the bank. But today is Monday. What will my excuse be? I'll transfer 40k to you now and then we'll balance them later. But the deposit is 200k. I'm trying. Try harder! Because if anything happens to me, I would never forgive you. Watch that tone. I'm not your mate. I'm working hard and I'll get the money and pay you. I get you out of this ghetto. No lights, no water, nothing. But this is our own. Where are you going to? Where do you think? The hospital, of course. At least one child has to show up. I will get you the money now, so. The money you promised me, I've not gotten it. Not talk about the interest promise. Even the job, nothing. I'm beginning to think you're just full of empty promises. Anderson, where's my money? Oh boy, who you now? Uh, I'm here to see your guy now. I say, who you drop? Ah, ah, calm down, now tiger I can't see now. No, no, guy I won't come see. Now you can't see. Just tell and say, I shall do here now. No, 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 thank you. I did, I did. I did come. Maggie. What have you been thinking about? Mm -hmm. What's wrong? I don't want to bother you. We're friends for a reason. What's wrong with you? My parents are traveling and they'll be away for a while. The maid in the house needs a place to stay and, you know, feed and all that. And I really cannot take that upon myself right now. Wow. You're really amazing. See you getting bothered over something that has nothing to do with you. Wow, I'm really happy we're friends. <laughs> Just who I am. But this maid of yours seems to bother you so much. How about I talk to Anderson and she'll come and clean weekly? Really? Yes. That will be really nice. No problem. She could come in next week. Um, he's a he. He? No problem. I'll talk to Anderson. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Don't stress, okay? Babe, a maid is coming in next week. A maid? What for? The house is big enough and it's cleaning. Mona, you're home a good percent of the time. I'm sure you can clean your house. Don't tell me you want me to clean this big house by myself. That's not what I'm saying. The last one we had, we've not even finished dealing with that. I am not asking you. I am telling you. So in case you see a boy around the house, don't be surprised. Did Nengi put you up to this? This has nothing to do with Negi. Can you leave her out of this? You know what? Do whatever you want. You've always done whatever you wanted, you brat. Brat! Have fun sleeping on the floor. Good night. Anderson, what are you doing here? So you think you're asleep, huh? It's past midnight, Anderson. What do you want? Hmm. Listen, I don't know what you're on about. That little stuff you put earlier, texting money about old men in relationship, dating, look at... What, what was that? Did that scare you? What's it? Why won't you just leave me and my life alone now? I want my one millionaire, Anderson. You know you're a psychopath with a twisted mind. 
Why are you really here, Anderson? Get your filthy hands off me. <laughs> really, Anderson? See, you know, I've had a very long day, so all of this is over. <laughs> it is not over until I get my one millionaire and my apartment. <laughs> Listen, I want to talk about just this conversation. Everything, you and I, you live in this house, your friendship with Muna, everything is over. Right here was a mistake. So you tell yourself? What do you want? I want you. I think you have a girlfriend. Does she satisfy your fantasies like I do? I thought as much. Just give me my money and my apartment, and I'll leave you and your little girlfriend alone. Thank you. Muna and I manage our finances. Why do you want me to tell her I'm moving that kind of money to? Uh, that's your people's problem. Borrow, steal, whatever. You're smart. You'll figure it out, Anderson. Nengi, stop daydreaming. That will never happen. I'm not playing, Anderson. You know what I want, Anda. You're a clown. <laughs> okay, Anderson. Is this how you want to do this? <coughs> uh, morning, Mona. Good morning. So, um, how's it going? Babe. So, um, you were sleeping and I don't want to wake you. Yeah, Nengi was just about to make us breakfast. Oh, what? Yeah, I was. Oh, really? So, what's for breakfast? Uh, baked beans, bread, and some sausages. Mm, yeah. Nice. Um, what about the maid you said was going to come in to work? Right. He'll come in tomorrow. Yeah. Hmm, fantastic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks like you two have things to discuss. I'll be upstairs. Yeah. Um, babe, uh, you know, um, alcohol before breakfast could ruin your taste bud. I'll survive. <laughs> breakfast. Yes. yes. <laughs> How fun? Is it done? You know there is no going back once we call action. Guy, hmm? my joke out to you. Okay, we hear from his camp. You know that. <laughs> hey, this guy don't go know it in it. You see the stress. Guys, I trust you. I'm getting the money, okay? Getting really, Nengi. The hospital said they're stopping treatment on Friday if no payment is made. I'm trying. If only could die. She's not going to die. Why did you have to lie to him that you're going to make the payment back? I have not been lying. Things are just really, really slow. But you know I can afford 200k by myself. Do you know the problems you're putting me in? I'll get the money, okay? You have to get it today. Not so. This 
is not just about the hospital payment. I'm getting it big. Don't you want to get out of this place? How? I hope this is not another lie. <sighs> Look, I'm working on something. I will be smiling soon. <laughs> what are you up to? I'll get the money and I'll pay in full. <laughs> Remember I helped you out in time of need. You better the same now. Because you owe me one, Nengi. Trust me. It's kind of hard to do that now. Meanwhile, I got your job. Tomorrow, we had two weeks. How do you want to write a 15 pager in one day? What page are you on? So, I'm almost actually done. I'm on page one. So, I'll finish up before I go to lunch with my friends. And you help me finish it out, please. Luna! Don't worry. I'll treat you on this party tomorrow after class. Thank you. I'll come and see your beautiful. Thank off. you. Thank you. My coffee has no sugar. Yes, ma'am. I'm impressed that she's doing this education thing. I told you, mommy, I was going to finish up. So what's your plan? What do you mean? So what's the plan with you, Nenki? It's because I've gotten you a job on Great Big Bird. So wait, if this was a pure plan, why didn't you tell me, brother? Or are you ashamed of me? Anyways, please, how can I get the money before Friday? I'm working on it. But Nenki, can't ask these people. They have money. They can help us. You think, Chris? You want to start madness now, 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 you just enter this house. Okay, so you think if that's how I was going up and down, begging like a papa, I'll be here. Sorry, I was just wondering. Stop wondering and focus on the job you are supposed to do. Now, wow. Hey, listen, Asha. When they are carrying out this process, you need to make sure it's not when Mona is there. <laughs> well, I understand the frustration. But then, I think the best thing is to know if she will be with her when we are carrying this out. Because hmm. nothing can happen to Mona in the process. Besides, her father will have our heads. And uh, I just don't even want her knowing what happened to Nengi. Okay, why don't you do this? Just call her to know where she is at the moment. You think Muna will listen to me if I tell her not to go anywhere? Well, it is worth trying. Just confirm where she is. Look, see, you're already on the second page. You just need to stop stressing about this thing, okay? <sighs> Negi, see, how do you do all these things? I just listen to the professors. Oh, thank you. Thank you. See, the only thing I want to write is my graduation speech, and I'm sure that will be very hard soon. You can just use mine when you get on that stage. Just say, later, losers. Really? Someone's <laughs> calling me. Hello? Hello? Hey, what's up? I'm fine. What do you want? I'm studying. Uh, I just wanted to know if you have any plans this evening. Yes, I'm going out with Shewa and Bernard. Why? Uh, just the three of you. Yes, why are you asking? Uh, nothing, I just wanted to know what you were doing for the rest of the day. Bye, you're clearly bored. Oh my goodness, what am I going to start with this? How's it? How's that? You're good, my name! 
We're good. Come Man, don't pop Let's already. Let's go. Nengi, there's no air of his. Antiretroviral drugs. Where did you find them? Just now in the trash. Jesus. Hmm, looks like somebody in this house has a I hope you don't know anything about this. Mm. Do I look like I have a to you? <laughs> there's no look to it. I'm not saying that you have. What is that? Nothing, man. I'm just clearing the kitchen. Better, cause snooping will get you fired. Nengi, this is no time to be sneaky. Hope you didn't have one protected sex with anybody here. What was that supposed to mean? <laughs> well, Mr. Larson is the only guy in this house. Except... You are crazy. I'm just looking out for my friend. It's just a yes or no question for crying out loud. Hmm. If anything, your friend needs to call sexual health medical experts. Do you know anyone just in case? Nobody's calling them. Hello? Good day, ma'am. I kind of need to get tested. May I know where you are to locate the closest center to you? Uh, where have you been? <laughs> I, I just needed to clear my head. Okay, anyways, um, I'm almost done with chapter two. Nah, please, I don't have time for this today. It's not by force to get a master's degree. If you cannot do it, then just quit. Are you a child? I don't understand. Can't you tell your parents that you don't want to do a master's degree? Please, I don't have time for this. Your constant needs. Please, I need to rest. I have so many things on my mind. It's not obvious. I had sex. Okay, okay. How many sexual partners do you have, though? Are you judging me? Oh, not at all. It's just for um, documentative purposes and so as to help us with research. I'd rather, I'd rather write it than say it. Okay, okay. Let me get you something. Here you go. Okay, okay. Have you had unprotected sex in the last three months? Yes. Do you know if your partner um, did HIV test? Okay, ma'am, you know what you do now? When you go out now, the door by your left, go there for your HIV test, so um, they will get your result to me and I will disclose it to you. Okay? okay. Thank you. You're welcome. But you still have to test again in three months. And once again, I would like to introduce you to the oral test kit. That's a self-test kit where you can take the test at the comfort of your home. Do you understand? Okay. okay. Thank so you. this is um, <coughs> PrEP. PrEP, um, 
it's um, a pre-exposure prophylaxis pill. It helps you prevent HIV. Do you understand? I would strongly advise you to use protections so as to stay away from um, STIs and other STDs. Do you understand? Thank you so much, Mama. Thank you very much. Do have Thank a good you. day. Whew. Bastard, right? Oh, so you knew you had HIV and you slept with me without protection. What are you talking about? I saw your pill in the trash. <sighs> Those are mine. Those are Muna's. What mine? Muna is HIV positive. Hey! But she's your girlfriend and you guys have sex, no? Okay, so the thing is, our viral load is very low. Right? Besides, I don't even touch that girl in eight months. And my family always makes sure I get tested every three months. <laughs> but we're fine. That's you people's business. So. Anderson, I'm getting another test in three months. And you better pray to whatever you serve that I'm fine. You're fine. In fact, you know, we can go get tested together, okay? Here, it's a self-care test kit. You can get your results in 20 minutes. So yeah, now. Users. So are you not coming back to the country club? So many things have happened that you've missed out on. Mm -mm. Shewa, you talk too much. Must you be the one to let her know that Biki's father was arrested by the EFCC for money laundering? Oh my goodness. See. How is she feeling now? <laughs> Broke? Definitely broke. Sure that they took out their whole family from the club. OMG, the old team was very humiliating. You should have been there. Wow. I feel so bad for her. Let me just let me call okay. her. And tell her what? Uh, She's just <laughs> empathy now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> empathy money. So where did you tell her you heard it from? True. So what's been happening? Now everyone thinks you're out of the country because your snaps is otherwise. You know how this master's program can be here, and I have to really keep that promise and study. <laughs> well, anyway, I hope that you will make it to the Maldives trip, <laughs> and will you be coming with Anderson? Speaking of Anderson, how are things going between you two? Um, we're doing great, and, <laughs> and we, lo we love each other so much, and it takes care of me. So, yes. <laughs> well, you kind of like take care of yourself. <laughs> You've got daddy's money anyway. I know, but like, no girl says not to like extra cash. Yeah, right. Mm. Uh, sorry, guys, um, I need to take this up. Yeah, right. sure. Yeah, I mm. She thinks I'll be the one to tell her boyfriend is a community pig. OMG, <laughs> you know about it. I think that's why she doesn't come into the country club anymore. I know, right? Such a shame. I don't know what she sees in that man. <laughs> Community, okay. never. Oh, so you're happy now. You've seen your results. Secondly, Anderson, where's my money? <laughs> Tomorrow is Thursday, and if I do not get my money by tomorrow, I'll be meeting Mr. Wadira at the golf club. Uh, well, Asha and I already promised you, we will get you the money. Um, what did you say tomorrow by 6 p.m.? That works, yeah? Why? Why can't you just do a transfer? Uh, I, I just want um, Asha to be there, you know. I witness, and we're good. Whatever. To you at 6 p.m. <laughs> and you better make sure it's complete. You won't be shh. Bro. Hello. Hey, Muna. We are about earlier. I had a couple of measures. Is everything okay? Everything is fine now. Okay. I see you're still on this essay. Not everyone is as book smart as you, Negi. <laughs> I'll help you. 
But I need to make a quick stop somewhere at 6 p.m. And on my way back, I'll get us junks and alcohol. And we can be up all night <laughs> to finish this. Thank you so much. Thank You're you. Welcome. And about the pills in the kitchen. I know what those pills are, Mona. Are you a pharmacist now? <laughs> my father is HIV positive also. What's that supposed to mean? I used to go and pick up his pills after school on my way to his office. I don't understand what you're talking about. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. And if I am, that's a good thing. I'm sorry for seeing what was in the trash. How's your father's health? Still alive and healthy? Neki, no one knows. Just had the same. It's not a death sentence, Mona. And besides, your secrets are safe with me. Is there ever going to be a cure? I really can't, I don't know, I really can't promise that, but I know that there are people and organizations working tirelessly to find a cure. And it's pretty easy to manage. Just take your medications. You'll be fine. I'm sure you know this. Thank you. You'll be fine. Thank you so much. It's okay. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> Untie me, son of monkeys. Who are you guys? Apologies. I'm Tiger, and this is Python. Doesn't talk very much. I want to get out of here now. Oh, I'm sure you do. Well, you see two boys for your front. You see the command. Where's Anderson? Who be that? I'm not joking. Who sent you? You, you need to stop struggling, so you don't get bruises on yourself. <laughs> Just let me go. How much are they paying you? You see, we are big on loyalty over here. We don't flip or snitch. I'll pay double. You know, he said you'll do this. Try to flip the table around us. He knows you too well. This is just two people. We don't do that over here! We don't flip or snitch! Alright, enough playing around. So here's the boy. We have two options for you. Option number one. We arrange a cab for you to take you anywhere. Anywhere that you want. And you will not contact Anderson or Muna ever again. You will not speak to them, you will not talk about them, and you will not know them. A cab. I'm a first class at <laughs> Bay. So you better go back and tell Anderson that he has just touched the tail of the lion. I rule him so bad. I must admit, I admire your confidence. Oh, please don't scare me. Option number two. You stay here with us, but let me tell you something. We know to get food for this place, so... <laughs> <laughs> I'm not afraid of death, so be my guest, because I'm not going anywhere. Very well then. Welcome home, my lady. Negi, time is going now. I won't be able to finish this thing today. Whatever, just text me or call me when you get this, please. Call me. Hey, how's it going? See, I'm supposed to study with Negi and she's not home. 
Hmm. That's all. Uh, is that food? Yeah, I left some for you in the microwave. But like, this is on like her. Her phone is not usually off. Hmm. Oh? Mm. She's an adult and... I think she's fine. Maybe she just went to her own house, you know? She promised to study with me today. Like, this is, this is strange. Hmm. Huh. Well, you better get to uh, studying on your own because... I don't think she'll be coming back today. Make <laughs> waste the money for Christ's sake. Turn on your stupid phone. I keep good money to yourself. So you think if I let you go, I wouldn't be the one in that position? Please. I beg you. Look at me. You're a very pretty girl. Who did you piss off? Because from what I hear, they are very, very powerful. What are you guys going to do to me? I suggest you take two warnings. Get out of here and leave town if possible. I, 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 are you going to kill me? Do you believe in God? Yes, yes, I, I do. Then pray to him. <laughs> I told you we will solve this. <laughs> Guy, my guess is they actually really scared her to death. Mm -hmm. Well. I'm wondering how long we're going to keep her there for. Okay, see, as long as we want, that girl needs to know that she can't just go around blackmailing people and getting away with it. Mm -hmm. You're right. Um, I just hope her parents um, don't start looking for her at some point. <laughs> okay, she's a walker. See, this is what they do. They disappear, they come back, they disappear. Just me. Nobody's looking for that girl. Well, now you sabi. Um, you know you have to pay extra for every day she's with them. Uh, just enough for her to learn a lesson. Oh, yeah. Okay. Good morning, sir. Mm -hmm. Um, Masco Company Dispatcher dropped the document for you this morning. Oh, that's so... Yes, sir. When did we employ you? Oh, well, yeah. This is the new secretary. I started work this Monday. This Monday? Mm. You and I should have a personal meeting at 2 p.m. Yeah, you can, you can leave now. Thank you, sir. Anderson. What is wrong with you? You just got out of a mess and you're dragging yourself into another. How? How? I'm only trying to get to know the new staff now. No, Anderson. No. Well, we are meeting with um, M&R Consulting firm to discuss their liquidation later today. Oh, yeah, yeah, you and do that one, do it, do it, do it. Hmm. Hey. Good morning, ma. Good morning, how are you? Um, Fine. When did you resume? 7 a.m. Oh, okay. So, did you run into Negi or like have you seen her? Mm, no, she was in the room when I was this morning. Uh, do you know where she could be? No, she didn't sleep on last night. Wow. All right, just let me know when she comes in. Okay, yes, ma'am. Yes, and um, please make me like hot chocolate. Yes, ma'am. What would you like for breakfast? Egg and sausage. And when you're done, let me squeeze fresh oranges and put them in the fridge. Okay, ma'am. All right, thank you. Um, 
So, were you serious about the six months raise? Um, what's your name again? Inkechi. Right, right. Yeah, I mean, as long as there's total quietness on this, you'll get it, Inkechi. Can I have my phone now? Have you flushed the condom? Yes, you're so overprotective about your image. I am Anderson Igbosin. I should be protective of my image. And also, remember to leave only 30 minutes after I leave this hotel. Okay, Anderson. It's Mr. Anderson to you. Sorry, sir. Mr. Anderson. <laughs> I told you, Muna. <laughs> You're telling me she really wanted you to feel that bad. I really don't know. A lot has just been off with her lately. I beg. I told you I don't trust that girl. Ugh. You don't know her. Mm -hmm. I know fake when I see fake. And she's fake. It's just really unlike her. <laughs> I beg. She's probably off on one of those quick trips and she can't post about it because she's not first class or a five-star hotel or all of those things. Bernard, you don't get it. She did not even take anything from her room. Nothing. Wait, I hope you're not saying that she's missing. We can't consider her missing. It's not 48 hours yet. Eh? Mona! <laughs> Wait, are you telling me you brought me to your house knowing there's a missing person? I beg, I cannot do jail time. Oh. Jail time? You yes! Are, you are extra. Mm. So when the police comes in here and starts to ask all of those questions, blah, 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 who is going to answer them, Abby? <laughs> me. Please, no. Muna, see, I love you, <laughs> but sort this out yourself, eh? Bye. Oh my goodness, I deal with a lot of crazy, stupid people. I'm tired. Where are you coming from? Work of course. You close at 6. This is 11 p.m. Why are you acting like you care? Of course I don't. Because you're coming from one of those cheap girls you sleep with. What are you talking about? I can smell that cheap perfume from a distance. Listen, I go to work every day to put food on our table to impress your father, take care of you. And this is all the bullshit I get. The only thing you come up with is STD, which I have to treat with <laughs> antibiotics. Coming from you, the one with the... Say it! I dare you to say it, and you say I'll cancel this fake stupid relationship in a heartbeat. No you sense. know what? I'll be sleeping in the living room tonight. Better. That's where you should sleep. And make sure you come outside before the maid sees you. I don't let them suspect anything. Whatever. Good night. Mm. Idiots. I don't know that bastard. Good morning. What are you doing here? She have been texting you, Amuna. Nobody's responding to me. How did you even get in here? Oh, I still have my keys. Sophie! What are you doing here? Uh-uh. I've come to resume my work now. We already have a new maid. Doesn't bother me. Sophie, we can't have two maids. This house isn't that big. We have a deal. You said you can't pay me for doing nothing monthly, so I offered to clean the house. So if you have something else for me to do. Anderson, I thought you sorted this. I thought she was gone for good. You have to sort this. Sure, always up to Anderson to sort everything. But she's your cousin. You must be the new maid, right? Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure I've seen her before. I miss Mina's sister. I wish. I'm Anantin's distant cousin. And I work here as a maid shop. Maid? Have I been fired? Yeah, I don't know. How can they have two maids? They have money. Why are you bothered? Anyways, I'm Sophie. Mm, nice to meet you, Sophie. Uh, but where have you been? Me? Well, um... I've been on vacation, but money don't finish now, so I'm here slaving away. Oh, welcome back. I need to sweep the compound. Where are you going? To drop us in the kitchen. Yeah, I know, but like, they don't like when we pass the front. 
She doesn't even like seeing us if she doesn't ask for the maids. Oh, uh, okay. Don't be offended, you know, that's just how rich brats are. Sure. Okay, so I need you to help me clean my sneakers in front of the door. I'm going for a walk later today. I cleaned the already, man. Okay, and mop the floor is a bit wet. Don't that as well. Wow. You're like, you're, you're working so hard. Where have you been all my life? <laughs> okay, since you've done pretty much everything, just take the day off and rest. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. And um, Anderson's clothes, put them in the laundry. Yes, ma'am. All right. All right. Muna. Muna, what are you <laughs> you get stabbed in Lagos for sneaking up oh. on people like that. It's been a long time. Imagine you're looking so sweet and stuff. You know? Come on, come on. Go. So what are you doing around here? Um, I have a client here, so I oh. decided to just get something from the car and then I saw you, my lucky day. You know? Wow, I see haven't you. seen you since uni. It's been a long time, man. It's been a long time. Uh, Actually, you're working on Let me just get a number, yeah. so I'll probably oh. catch up and give you a call. Okay, no problem. no problem. All right. Okay. Yes. I'll give you a call. Right, I'll, I'll see you. I'll call you, right? Bye, Bye baby. What are you doing? Just writing down a list of groceries needed. Since when? This is my first time. Why are you sucking up to her? You know she's not on your level, right? Hope you don't like her or something. Ew, what are you saying? She just asked me to do the list. You're already doing too much, okay? I handle the grocery shopping. You stick to cleaning. But she asked me to do this list. I handle all the money matters. You don't. So don't annoy me and just play your part, okay? I think you should have that conversation with her. Wow! They really gave me those dozen slaps I told them to. Have you lost your mind, Anderson? I want to get out of here and I want to get out of here now. Or what? Or what? I swear to God, if you don't let me. Baby, listen, listen. Remember your first threat got to you. Are you sure you want to keep making threats? Anderson, please. Huh? I'm begging you. So you, you can beg. So you can beg. So. I brought an affidavit that states that you have been a threat to my girlfriend and I. So, you will sign it. Sign it! You will sign it that you will stay far away from us. Going to happen to me now. Well, by tomorrow, I will decide what will happen to you. Anderson, please. These guys are so ruthless. <laughs> See you in hell, Nengi. Anderson, and Anderson, please. Anderson, please. I'm begging you. Where have you been? I've been worried sick. What happened to you? What happened? Are you are you okay? What happened? Thank you, your face. What happened to you? I'll tell you later. How's mommy? I'm going to see her now at the hospital, but I'll go to work then. I'll be back early. There's beans in the pots. Okay. 
Well, are you okay? You can't tell Muna about me just yet. <coughs> I know, I know, but don't go anywhere. Just wait right here till I'm back. You hear? Okay. Lock the doors. Right? Bastards. Ah, oh, they really showed me. Look at my body. I'm dusting. I won this time, but it's not over at all. Yeah, Asha. Um, I'm on my way. No, I'm out of the house now. You send me Hold on, let me call you back. Sophie, what do you want? I brought you a glass of scotch. Hmm. Uh, I'm good. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. But you always take a glass of scotch in the morning before work. Sophie, what has gotten into you? Anderson, you've just dismissed me. We're family, remember? <laughs> Sophie, family don't do what you're doing to me. Okay? See, we might be related by blood, but we are not family. I'm sorry now. I didn't put you in any trouble. Sophie, just quit this job. You're educated. Go back to Enugu. Go and meet your parents. Quit? Never gonna happen, okay? And you can't fire me, so... Whatever. I asked for Noso. Oh, um, he's not around. He's late. That's unlike him. No, uh, he comes late sometimes. Just that I've done most of the things by that time, so you don't really notice. Mm, is that so? Okay. What would you like? When Noso gets back, tell him to get me a cup of coffee. Okay. Should I put milk in it or? I said Noso will do it. Thank you. You can go now. Okay. Um... Thank you. Bye-bye. Mm? Who is this? What's he the fire? Come close. Waka come! I give you that now. Hey. Hey, relax. Hey, time, bro. <sighs> Babe, how far? We never see your face in like a few years now. I know. I've been away. <laughs> you speak English. Hey, I will see you come carry you come back. Huh? I need some money. I'll pay you back in a week. It's in the trouble you really need some money. You know, see. We know you find girl when it comes to money, matter big. I know. I'll pay you back in a week. How much? 80k. I'll give you 10 days. You get your money back. Yes. Shabla, okay. Baba. Go bring 80,000 pounds. Thank you very much. I'll pay you back in a week. You know, say I fall for you. Why does it look sad in here? Who chop your biscuits? A lot has been taken away from me, Jigo. By who? Maybe help you fuck him up. I have a plan. And uh, who be this guy, Seth? His name is Anderson Igbison. You know what? I'll have a hundred thousand naira if you can help me fuck him up. How won't he get that? I'll give you his office address and every other detail you need to know. Yeah, no wala now. Thank you so much, Dico. I give it to you. I have to go now. But I fall for you. Yeah. Good morning, Sophie. 
You're late. I know. Sorry. I had to attend some things. Well, your mother wants coffee. So make it. She wants you to make it and bring it to her. Where's the coffee? I don't know. But I will keep it here. Maybe check the pot. It's not funny. Where's the milk? I don't know. See, I was just gonna tell her I had a coffee and milk. I don't have time for all this. Wait! This is your milk. <laughs> Good morning, man. So sorry, oh, man. Oh, no problem. Just drop it by the dresser okay. there. What should I make for breakfast? Um, I'm not hungry, but yes, I need you to help me get something, a pill at the pharmacy. Okay, so yes. what do I tell them for? Um, it's a premenstrual syndrome pill. It's used for like menstrual pains and heavy flow. Okay, man, I'll be back soon. No problem. Thank you. What are you doing here? I, I was just cleaning the door. Please get out. Sorry. Stupid girl. Nengi. Why are you here? You didn't even call me. I'm sorry, I don't... I didn't have a phone. I just got one on my way here and I even had to retrieve my SIM. You don't have a phone. Why? Were you robbed? I went to see Jigon. Jigon? Same Jigon? Yeah. I had to borrow some money to get a new phone and some Nengi, no now. We left that place and promised to also this thing ourselves and you went back there. Or have you forgotten what you did to Shalewa? You understand, Tiwa. A lot has been taken away from me. I don't know about this. It's risky. Jigon is dangerous. Um, Tiwa, I need a place to stay where I can, you know, figure this whole thing out. Can I stay here for a while? Sure, babe, you can stay with me. I mean, I'm going to Abuja for a while, so the house is going to be free. That's fine. <sighs> Thank you so much, Tiwa. Thank you so much. That's fine. So, tell me what's been happening in your life, what's been <sighs> going on. Just me now. First off, this is a very nice space. Um, thank you. I'm back to my question. What's been happening in your life? Oh. What's wrong with you? What are you talking about? I cannot take this, you know. Take what? You! Always giggling and laughing with her. She just makes funny jokes sometimes, and what do you want me to do? How long have you been here? Just about a month. And you're always acting like you know everything about her. I've been here over a year, and I don't know anything about her. She doesn't even talk to me. Sophie, why are you acting like this? No, so why are you acting like the world's best maid? Look, and making me look bad. Hmm? I'm sorry if I've ever offended you. Just quit this job. No way, I need the money. No, you need to go back to where you're coming from. I'll just take it like you're on a period. Now, what do you know about periods? Wait, look, I have a sister I love so much, and she gets like this whenever she's on a period, so. I'm even going on my period, so what? Good afternoon, sir. What do you want? Um, so I was hoping we could see today after work. Um, it's my birthday and I'm having dinner with a few of my friends. Huh, interesting. 
So what makes you think I understand would want to be a dinner with you and your friends? For what reason? We're just celebrating. Nothing major, sir. Huh. Is that so? Thanks for the thoughtful invite, but no thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Okay, too. Sir? Happy birthday. Thank you, sir. Are you serious? You were fired. Yes, so that's why I even planned this Mabuja trip so I can see what's there for me. I'm so sorry, T. Hmm? I beg go. Those are my bosses were horrible people. <laughs> no regrets. Oh no, wow. So babe, how do you intend to pay Jigo back in a week? I've got a plan. Hmm. Nengi. Okay. Oh. Nengi. Nengi. She, I told this girl not to go anywhere. Nengi, where are you? She, I told you not to leave this house. See, just tell me where you are so I'll come and get you now. Ah. Me, I'm tired, though. Ah. See, they make you shout like woman self. How did you get in here? Oh God, you know they ask me stupid questions. Please, just take anything you want. Please, anything. It is a bit thief. Eh? No, 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 sir. No, sir. No, sir. No, I'm sir. on Mina Street, and I request me I get for you. You don't offend one of our own. Maybe I'm the wrong person. I didn't offend anybody. See, eh, thank you, Nengi, to make I tell you, say you the one. I make you just do it in the right, if not, you know it's in uh, the next now. Uh, uh, yeah, but I, I don't owe her. I don't owe her. Waiting big boy like you said, the world will be seen if you even sort. Uh, eh? Waiting uh, big boy. Yeah, I don't, I don't, uh, I don't. Uh. Bros, just sort it out, though. Yes, just sort uh, it. Yes, sir. If not, see this knife. Go enter your body. Sorry, sir. Guy, you're sure you don't need a drink right now? Yeah, I don't need anything, I beg. Ah, uh -uh. What's wrong with you? This hard guy. No, that girl is just troubled. I'm not going away. So, what do you want to do? I think I'm just gonna have her arrested. Hmm. Arrested? Are hmm. you sure our people won't come, you know, pestering and asking you questions? Don't you think she just pay her off? <laughs> Never. Okay. Place a call right now. Just, you know, talk to her. I don't. You're threatening me. I am Anderson Igbosom. 
You had people kidnap me, Anderson. Those dirty boys. You will go to jail. I'm not just a slut like you, you know. You should have killed me when you had the chance. You better send me my money or you'll be getting some more where that came from. Stupid. I think I'm just gonna have to pay her this money. You're bigger than one million era, right? You just explained to Mona that you needed it for something important. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Just call your account manager to transfer the money. You know how Tiger is dangerous. You don't know how dangerous this other guy is. <sighs> My drink. Yeah. I asked you though. Guys. I told you I was gonna make it big. Now, your sister here is ready to pay her debt. No, so. No, so. Why are you crying? Oh, sister. Jesus. Why? I have the money now. You. You raised your life. You caused it. No, so. I, I know you don't mean what you're saying. I, I, I tried. I think you tried. I know that you're hurting, but I, di I didn't want for this to happen. No, so you need to believe me. I didn't want for this to happen. I just need to get out of here. Where are you going to? No, so. I just need to no, get so. Morning to you too. And it's Saturday. Sophie. Um, I need you to help me get something at the store. Okay, what's that? Anything. Buy me a drink or something. Anything. There's drinks in the store. I know. Go and get me drinks at the store. Okay. Let me get my bag. No, 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 no. Use my card code. It's recharged. Just go past the front. Okay. Um. <sighs> Babe, I'm really worried. Inegi hasn't been to this house for like three weeks. She's not posting on her Instagram. She's not posting anywhere. She's not a child. But what do you mean? If anyone should ask where she was last seen, it would be here. So I don't, I don't get what you're saying. What is asking? Don't you be thinking suspicious that we don't know anybody that knows her? Babe, I'm worried. Even Mosso hasn't been to the house in like a week. Mm. Did you say why? Yeah, he sent a text saying something about family. Imagine, I'm just worried. Maybe she, maybe she left the country. You know how you girls beef. Are you serious right now? You're so useless. Nonsense. This girl they play with fire, and she knows say me. I know they use my money clear. Then you don't know Allah, just they ignore me. But just no say you don't fuck up. And I'll be what dare you say? I don't trust that be. I dare you. She don't mess up. And she said she don't say me at the craze, at the mad. Chris Vogram. <laughs> Mm. 
Nengi, please get up. You need to eat something. It's been almost two weeks now. You can't keep drinking water now. I'm not hungry. I know, but you need to eat something. Or do you want me to call now, so? My problem is gone. I don't even know what to do. I'm so sorry, babe. I can only imagine how you feel. <laughs> I feel alive. But I don't at the same time. No, but you still need to eat something. For you and for non so. Do you know if you wouldn't even speak to me? I could have done something. No, oh, you told me you tried your best. You tried everything. Anderson. What does he have to do with all this? He could have helped me. I could have saved her. Babe, I know it's easy to blame anybody right now, but you can't pin this one on him. He really could have helped me earlier. I should have helped Okay, Nengi, <laughs> calm down, okay? <laughs> Ah, Chico, what are you doing here? How did you enter our house? Me and Nengi did. See, uh, me, I don't want to enter trouble, so please, you have to leave. I mean, you follow talk that one. I said, me and Nengi. She's not here. And now, look, would like me to lose this off and boil you. I'm just coming from burying my mother. I can't deal with this now. Mama, Nengi, don't die. Ah, oh. and that woman feed us where we are for area where we small low. Now I go respect this moment now, eh? You could just tell me when Nengi did, and I go come out. I, I, I can't tell you that. Me, I no go like me to lose this or fine boy you. Oh. Oh. You made me go all the way and the card wasn't even loaded. No phone to call or anything. I must have forgotten to load it. And what are you using that you're always trying to hide? See, I don't want to be the one to tell Anderson that I are doing drugs though. What is your problem? Why are you back here? Why can't you just leave and leave for good? I work here. We do not want you. Babe! Babe, what please come and use rope to hold your dog because I'm tired. I do not want her here. She has to leave right now. Wait, what, what is going on here? What is going on here? I didn't even do anything. Oh, I just came inside and saw her doing drugs. What? Sophie, you know what? Enough is enough. Go and pack your bags. You're fired. Go back to Enugu. You. you can't fire me. I know you're upset right now, but I need you to think about what you're saying. Babe, is this what you do when I'm out? Bring dirty hoes to our bed? No, 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 no. Do not call me a hoe. You can still talk. Calm down, calm down. You can still talk. Come to another man. Come to another man. Wait, 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 wait. What? Ah. My God, Mona, what did you do? This, 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 this is not my fault now. Just, just calm down. Just calm down. Uh, let's just call the police. Which police? It's going to be your word versus mine. And you know Papa will be on my side. So I will definitely be free. Muna, your fingerprints are on now. Ah, uh -uh. what you in Nigeria? Your fingerprints are also on how? When you were kissing and grabbing her, I beg go. Okay, okay, wait. No, no, nobody is calling the police. Um, we need to know how to get rid of this body without anybody knowing. Hi, sorry, I had no. Um, oh my God, is that? No, no, no. There's nothing to see. Go, go. Oh my God, she saw us. She saw us. Just calm down. Just calm down. I'll take care okay. of it. I'll take care of it. Just make sure nobody enters. I'll take care of it, okay? Um, um. Sophie! 
Anderson, short dismiss. Andy, I'm not the enemy here. You, you know what? While I start this mess, just go and pack your things. You need to leave. Even if it's just for now, you need to go. Go and pack this. Go and pack your things. See, eh? You not respectful quit for this area. And I'm not supposed to treat you like this. But when it comes to my money, I know it clearly. <coughs> now tell me where your sister did. <coughs> Hello. <coughs> Alpha. You there sure? <coughs> I know what I did come. I did come now now. <coughs> Is she gone now? Yeah, I've given her money to stay in the hotel for some I don't place. care. I just want her gone. I don't want to see that again. Wait. I'm tired. Where are you going? I'm going out. Muna! Is that Negi? What? Where have you been? I have something to tell you. Exactly. Why did you ghost on everyone? I've been sleeping with your boyfriend and it's been going on for a while. Sh sh shut up! Shut up! What are you saying? Let her speak. I actually smelled your cheap perfume on him a few times. But I knew this idiot would be trying to toast you and talk to you. But I expected you as my friend to reject him and turn him down. Oh, clearly, you don't know me well enough. Thanks to your boyfriend, I don't wear cheap perfumes anymore. Babe, babe, wait. See, I can't explain. Explain what? <laughs> but, no, wait, wait, wait. Be careful with me, baby. I sue. Babe, it's not worth it. Let me go. It's funny how this idiot disappeared. The next thing, a million moved from the account. I better take my leave now. Yes, you leave. Babe, listen, I'm sorry. See, I have nothing to say to you. I am tired. I have suffered. I have cared for you. I have loved you. And all you could do is embarrass me, drag my name, babe, and done. Babe, it's over. Babe, no, 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 no. Babe. babe. Um, this is good. Babe, we're not, let's talk about it now. Jigo, what are you doing here? And you know I don't need an invite to enter anywhere. I was going to call you today, actually. You don't take me for Mumu Abi. First, you don't pay me waiting you owe me. And second, you tell me that 250k that Anderson boy they owe you. There were not millions. Who told you that? <laughs> you say you don't die today. Please, I'll pay you. <coughs> Nengi, I did very sorry. But you know, say, my business matter, I need to make consign money. It did different, and I know they use and play. But you know, say, I fall for you now. Eh? I'm sorry. I should have told you. You think I'm not go find you, Abby? I'm sorry. I go try to reach my picking for your sake. And you know, say I need the road that way now, Nengi. But now, because of saying are you, I run now. I'll go to the bank tomorrow and make sure I pay the money. Make tomorrow no pass tomorrow, Pengi Nengi. I promise. But anyway, you still gotta suffer for. You still gotta suffer for Chico, the whole lies where you tell me. Chico, I'm begging. You don't see like the code with that now. You don't need beg me. Chico, please. You I'll be, Chico, please. I'm begging you. you Chico, please. I'm uh, <laughs> actions always have consequences, Pengi Nengi. But no, be I suppose they treat like this now. No, the test boys again. No, the test boys. Big. Because no, be as I suppose they treat like this. My own person now. Eh? Ah. Chico, please stop. Nengi. 
Why you make me run you like this? Now they make me the treat like all these street girls. Are you my person? Ah, you go way back. And I beg no verse for your mom, see? Eh? Take heart. But I beg. My money tomorrow, no forget. This is not your fault, Rick. It's not your fault. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Have you been crying? No, I'm okay. Nothing's wrong. Thank you. This is me, oh, me. Talk to me. I promise there's nothing wrong. Okay, have you eaten? Yes, I had the rice in the kitchen. Oh, okay. That's fine. I'm just gonna go use the bathroom. And then we'll come back we could talk, okay? Alright. Okay. <sighs> Hello? Jigan, did she drop any money? Eh, I better make sure I get my money. Oh. Okay, I trust you. Anderson, would you come down, please? Asha, says she's. Done. She's gone with every penny I own. Um, okay, I understand. She's hungry, yeah? But just let her calm down. And you know it's your fault. Asha, this isn't the time to point fingers, okay? Okay. Let me talk to her. <laughs> you actually think Muna gives a damn about you and I? <laughs> think again. Um, you know what? Let her calm down. Um, did she even mention where she was going? No, 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 no. no. Oh. Asha, what happens if she goes home? I can't lose it all. Andy, relax. Let me think. No, she has to pay for this. Nengi has to pay for this. <laughs> no, no. We are done with that sex worker for good. No, no, no. Listen, Asha. She cost all of this. Andy, calm down. Let me get you a bottle of beer. So Jigon was here. How did he get this address? I don't know. This is dangerous, Nengi. How deep are you in this thing? <laughs> I've been deep in things, but I've never gotten this deep. So what are you going to do now? I don't know. Where are you going to get the amount of money to pay him? How do you know how much it is? 
I don't. I just assume it's a lot. Yes, it is. I'm trying to figure it out. I've been doing that since I was 14. I'm sorry you had to go through all this pain. It's okay. Uh, do you know anywhere where I can get a rape kit? Did it touch you? No, I'm trying to get some information from my friend. Oh, okay. I know a sexual harassment center in Keja. They offer free medical checkup and even legal support. I'll look them up for you. Thank you very much. How old is she? Um, he's a guy actually. He's an adult. Oh, okay. Then you could just Google um, sexual harassment centers. Okay. I'm sure you get something. Thank you. You're welcome, babe. Who is that? It's not so, and I really cannot deal with him shouting at me right now. Nengi, you're home? I've been trying to reach you. Was your friend able to get the rape kit? How is Nonso? I am frustrated. What's wrong? You know, Sometimes when you come home, there's this cheap smell from your clothes. And I've been trying to remember where I know that smell from. So on my way here, it actually hit me. It's that same cheap ghetto smell as you go. Nengi, are you serious? What are you trying to insinuate right now? You know I don't hang with you go. I don't play with fire. Oh. I hope so, Tiwa. I hope so. Because my brother is lying in the hospital with a broken rib. What happened to him? <laughs> if anything ever happens to Nonso, I'll make sure I kill that person. Nothing will happen to Nonso in Jesus' name. Give me your phone. Why? Just give it to me. Here. Thank <laughs> you. 